The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, much of the time hailed as the swap for the Hubble Space Telescope, has improved how we may decipher the universe since its send-off. The telescope has given a striking viewpoint on the universe, uncovering mysteries and destinations already incredible by humanity. The JWST's cutting-edge innovation has allowed specialists to look into the farthest ranges of space, exploring worlds, stars, and planetary frameworks shaped billions of years prior. This article plunges into the various parts of the JWST, from its mechanical marvels to its noteworthy discoveries, and examines how it has reshaped how we might interpret the universe. To see the value in the importance of the JWST, it is critical to understand its ancestor, the Hubble Space Telescope, sent off in 1990. Hubble furnished stargazers with the first clear pictures of far-off universes, nebulae, and stars, liberated from the darkening impacts of Earth's atmosphere. Hubble's commitments to science are huge, from deciding the pace of the universe's development to noticing the effect of comet Shoemaker-Levy 9 with Jupiter. Its deep field pictures, catching light from galaxies billions of light years away, have given us a brief look into the early universe. However, regardless of its successes, Hubble had impediments. Its essential mirror, with a 2.4-meter width, restricted its light ability to assemble, and its instruments were intended for bright, visible, and near-infrared bits of the range. As stargazers pushed the limits of our understanding, a new telescope was required, one capable of finding in the infrared range, where it could look through vast dust clouds and notice the universe's earliest galaxies. The idea for the James Webb Space Telescope began to come to fruition in the mid-1990s, even before Hubble had arrived at its maximum capacity. Named after James E. Webb, NASA's head during the Apollo era, the JWST was imagined as the next great observatory, a telescope that would look further back in time than Hubble, catching light from the first stars and galaxies that formed after the Big Bang. The JWST's design presented critical engineering challenges. Unlike Hubble, which orbits Earth at a height of around 570 kilometers, the JWST would be situated at the second Lagrange point, L2, approximately 1.5 million kilometers from Earth. This area offers a stable climate with minimal interference from Earth's heat and light, but it also means the telescope can't be overhauled or fixed by astronauts. To notice faint, far-off objects, the JWST required a much larger mirror than Hubble's. The arrangement was a segmented mirror made of 18 hexagonal, gold-coated sections, giving the telescope a complete width of 6.5 meters. This mirror had to be folded to fit inside the Ariane 5 rocket and only spread out once the telescope reached its objective. The JWST also required a sunshield to block heat and light from the sun, earth, and moon, keeping the telescope's instruments at a temperature just a couple of degrees above absolute zero. The sunshield, the size of a tennis court, is made of five layers of a unique material called captain, which can endure extreme temperatures. After long years of planning, delays, and cost overruns, the JWST was finally sent off on December 25, 2021. The launch was a pivotal occasion watched by scientists and space fans worldwide. The Ariane 5 rocket carried the telescope into space, and over the next 30 days, the JWST set out on a complex, carefully planned succession of tasks. The telescope sunshield was the first major component to deploy, a process that involved various systems and a multitude of parts working in harmony. Any failure at this stage could have jeopardized the mission. Once the sun shield was successfully deployed, the mirror segments began to unfurl and adjust themselves. This cycle took a while, as each segment had to be positioned with nanometer accuracy. By mid-2022, the JWST had completed its commissioning and alignment, and its instruments were ready to begin gathering data. The first images released to the public were nothing short of amazing. The telescope's capacity to see in the infrared unveiled the universe in a new light, with dazzling clarity and detail. One of the essential objectives of the JWST is to notice the first galaxies that formed after the Big Bang billions of years ago. These galaxies are so far away that their light has been stretched into the infrared range because of the expansion of the universe, a phenomenon known as redshift. Hubble could recognize these far-off objects, but the JWST's infrared abilities allowed it to see them in incredible detail. In its most memorable year of operation, the JWST made several noteworthy discoveries. 
One of the most critical was the identification of galaxies that existed a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. These galaxies appeared larger and more developed than previously suspected, challenging existing theories of galaxy formation and evolution. Researchers had long believed that the first galaxies were small and gradually grew over time by merging with other galaxies. However, the JWST observations suggest that some galaxies formed much more quickly and grew larger sooner than anticipated. This finding has prompted cosmologists to reconsider their models of galaxy formation and evolution. The JWST also captured images of massive structures that had never been seen before. For example, the telescope noticed the intricate details of the cosmic web, a vast network of filaments that connects galaxies across the universe. These filaments, made of dark matter and gas, act as the scaffolding on which galaxies form and evolve. The JWST's observations of the cosmic web have provided new insights into the large-scale structure of the universe and the role of dark matter in shaping it. The JWST has also transformed our understanding of star formation and stellar evolution. Stars form in dense clouds of gas and dust, which block visible light. However, infrared light can penetrate these clouds, allowing the JWST to observe the process of star formation in unprecedented detail. One of the telescope's earliest targets was the Orion Cloud, a stellar nursery located about 1,344 light-years from Earth. The JWST images revealed numerous young stars, some of which were still embedded in their birth clouds. These observations have provided new insights into how stars form and evolve, as well as the processes that lead to the formation of planetary systems. The JWST has also observed the final stages of stellar evolution, capturing stunning images of dying stars and the clouds they produce. These observations have shed light on the processes that govern the end of a star's life, including the formation of white dwarfs, neutron stars, and black holes. Perhaps one of the most intriguing aspects of the JWST mission is its ability to study exoplanets, planets that orbit stars outside our solar system. The telescope's instruments can analyze the atmospheres of these distant worlds, searching for signs of habitability and potentially even life. In its most memorable year of operation, the JWST made several key discoveries related to exoplanets. One of the most notable was the detection of LHS 475b, an exoplanet located around 41 light years from Earth. This planet is roughly the same size as Earth and orbits its star in just two days. The JWST observations revealed that LHS 475b has a thick atmosphere, possibly composed of water vapor, carbon dioxide, or methane. The JWST has also observed other exoplanets with a range of atmospheric conditions. Some of these planets have thick, hazy atmospheres rich in methane and other hydrocarbons, while others have clear atmospheres dominated by hydrogen and helium. These observations have provided valuable information on the diversity of planetary systems and the conditions that could support life. One of the most captivating questions in cosmology is whether life exists elsewhere in the universe. While the JWST cannot directly detect life, it can look for biomarker substances, chemical indicators that might suggest the presence of life. For instance, the discovery of oxygen or methane in an exoplanet's atmosphere could imply the presence of biological processes. The JWST's ability to study exoplanets has opened a new era in the search for life beyond Earth. As the telescope continues to observe more planets, it will provide essential data that could help answer the age-old question. Are we alone in the universe? In addition to its investigations of distant galaxies and exoplanets, the JWST has captured images of some of the most beautiful and mysterious objects in the universe. One of the most striking is the Tarantula Nebula, a vast star-forming region located in the Large Magellanic Cloud, a satellite galaxy of the Milky Way. The Tarantula, also known as 30 Doradus, is a massive region of gas and dust where thousands of new stars are being born. The JWST images of this area reveal intricate filaments of gas, glowing clusters of young stars, and the remnants of supernova explosions. These observations have provided new insights into the processes that drive star formation and the life cycles of massive stars. The JWST has also captured stunning images of nebulae, such as the Eagle Nebula and the Pillars of Creation revealing details that were previously hidden from view. 
These images have not only captivated the public's imagination, but have also provided valuable information to astronomers studying the birth and death of stars. While the JWST has made remarkable strides in our understanding of the universe, its journey has not been without challenges and controversy. The telescope's development was plagued by delays and cost overruns, with the final price tag reaching almost $10 billion, far higher than the initial estimate. These issues sparked debates among scientists and policymakers about the practicality and value of the project. Some critics argued that the resources allocated to the JWST could have been better spent on other scientific endeavors, while others contended that the telescope's potential for groundbreaking discoveries justified the cost. The James Webb Space Telescope's mission isn't simply a scientific endeavor, but a human achievement that transcends boundaries and ages. Its revelations are already reshaping textbooks and expanding our understanding of the universe, but its full impact will unfold over the coming years. As the JWST continues to explore the universe, it will undoubtedly make even more significant discoveries, pushing the limits of human knowledge and inspiring generations to reach for the stars. The JWST represents a monumental leap forward in the field of cosmology, not just due to its cutting-edge technology, but also because of the new questions it raises about the universe. As it continues its mission, the JWST is poised to expand our understanding of cosmic phenomena in ways that were previously unimaginable. One of its most compelling capabilities lies in its ability to study the early universe, capturing the light from the most distant galaxies. These early galaxies are crucial to understanding how the universe formed and evolved. By observing them, researchers can gain insights into how galaxies formed, evolved, and merged in the early stages of the universe. The JWST's ability to detect faint infrared signals from these distant objects allows cosmologists to study them in detail, revealing the processes that shaped the universe shortly after the Big Bang. Additionally, the JWST is instrumental in studying the formation and evolution of supermassive black holes, mysterious objects believed to reside at the centers of most galaxies, including our own Milky Way. Understanding how these black holes formed and evolved is key to grasping galaxy formation and evolution. Another area of interest for the JWST is the investigation of dark matter. Dark matter, which makes up about 27% of the universe's mass and energy, does not produce light or energy, making it invisible and detectable only through its gravitational effects. By mapping the distribution of dark matter in galaxy clusters and large-scale cosmic structures, the JWST provides valuable information that helps researchers better understand the nature and role of dark matter in the universe. The JWST's ability to study exoplanets goes beyond merely detecting their presence. It also allows for detailed analysis of their atmospheric composition. By examining the light that passes through an exoplanet's atmosphere as it transits in front of its parent star, researchers can identify the chemical makeup of the atmosphere. This method, known as transmission spectroscopy, is crucial for detecting potential biomarkers like oxygen, methane, or water vapor. These observations are essential for assessing the habitability of exoplanets and understanding the conditions that could support life. The telescope's capabilities also extend to studying the formation and distribution of planetary systems. The JWST can observe protoplanetary disks, regions around young stars where planets are forming. By studying these disks in detail, cosmologists can learn about the processes that lead to planet formation and the dynamics that influence the development of planetary systems. This research provides important context for understanding the formation and evolution of our own solar system. Moreover, the JWST contributes to our knowledge of stellar populations and their evolution by observing star clusters at various stages of their life cycles. The JWST helps researchers understand how different types of stars form, evolve, and end their lives. These observations offer insights into stellar processes, such as nucleosynthesis, the creation of new elements in stars, and the role of supernovae in enriching the interstellar medium. The telescope also plays a critical role in studying the interstellar medium, the matter that exists in the space between stars. This medium comprises gas, dust, and cosmic rays, and plays a pivotal role in the cycle of matter in the universe. By investigating the composition and distribution of the interstellar medium, 
the JWST helps researchers understand how stars and planetary systems form and evolve, and how the elements essential for life are distributed throughout the universe. In addition to its scientific contributions, the JWST has a significant impact on technology and engineering. The development of the telescope required advancements in material science, optics, and precision engineering. For instance, the telescope's segmented mirror and sun shield involved innovations in materials that could withstand the harsh conditions of space. The technological advancements developed for the JWST have applications beyond astronomy, influencing fields such as remote sensing, telecommunications, and robotics. The JWST mission also enhances global collaboration in space science. As a joint venture between NASA, the European Space Agency, ESA, and the Canadian Space Agency, CSA, the JWST represents a collaborative effort that unites the expertise and resources of multiple countries. This global partnership fosters cooperation and the sharing of knowledge, strengthening the international scientific community's ability to explore and understand the universe. The telescope's observations also have a broader cultural and educational impact. The stunning images and discoveries made by the JWST have captivated the public's imagination and inspired a new generation of scientists and engineers. By engaging the public with its findings, the JWST fosters interest in science and technology, encouraging young people to pursue careers in these fields. As the JWST continues its mission, it will undoubtedly uncover new phenomena and challenge existing theories. Its observations will continue to refine our understanding of the universe, pushing the boundaries of human knowledge and expanding our perspective on the cosmos. The insights gained from the JWST will contribute to fundamental questions about the origins of the universe, the nature of dark matter and dark energy, and the potential for life beyond Earth. In summary, the James Webb Space Telescope represents a pivotal leap in our exploration of the universe. Its advanced technology and capabilities are reshaping how we understand cosmic phenomena, from the formation of galaxies and black holes to the investigation of exoplanets and the interstellar medium. The JWST's contributions extend beyond cosmology, impacting technology, global collaboration, and public engagement with science. As it continues to explore the universe, the JWST will provide new insights and inspire future generations to reach for the stars.